Well, variety has been the name of the game in weather for the Wabash Valley. News 10's Joe Ostrowski takes a look at how people are making the most of this unusual weather. From warm sunny days to cold snowy nights, then right back again. Weather in the Wabash Valley has been all but predictable this year. Say I was playing golf about three days ago, and now I'm wearing a winter hat. Those who've been through their share of Midwest winters say this is nothing new. It, it goes in cycles. And there's a, like last year, all the snow we had, and uh, we only had like three and a half inches already this year. So that's fine with me. The last of those inches fell Sunday night, leaving a scene pretty enough to draw both man and beast outdoors. But for many, like the McQueens here, the cold is still enough to keep all their activities indoors, even exercise. I'll be glad when I can get outside, though, because I like to gawk around and visit and all that stuff, you know. Maybe the summer will be an improvement, too. Just when those comfy outdoor days will return remains to be seen. In Terre Haute with photojournalist Mike Latta, Joe Ostrowski, News 10. Meanwhile, the first day of spring comes two weeks from tomorrow.